We got boy Manta. We got the Manta. Hey, what's up, y'all? The breezy back. The last unboxing I did was when I got my PS4. I was like 2014, December 2014. But now I got some more serious gaming PC, boy. We about to unbox this mug. Let's see what this got. Come closer. Got close up, so we got all this garbage in this. I don't know what this is. All right, so we got a little box first. <clears throat> so what is this? So this is a gaming mouse that comes with it. Um, this is the dual band 11 AC wireless USB adapter. So that's the internet, so you can get wireless internet. I'm guessing this is a HDMI cable. Yeah, it is. Directions and just what has in it. There we go again. All right, so the PC is right here, and it comes. Game what? And he comes with. Uh, and he comes with the. And it comes with a keyboard yeah. too, but it's wired. It's only a bad thing. So here goes the big part. We're gonna take out this big PC. I think it's like two feet tall. It's huge. Ah, uh, I'm gonna take this out. Yeah. Yep. I don't know what to do. Alright, so what I will do when you unbox it, just flip it around. And then the phone should, should come out like this. Now lift up. Intelligence, that's key. Woo! Look at it from closer. Look at this. So it's got about a few two USB cords in the back. Yeah, all this phone by the way. It's got about most of USB cords in the back. Uh oh, it's got more than that. It's got a lot of uh off course for audio. It's not, it's not even that heavy either. And this is all the stuff it has in it. When you power it up, it's gonna turn to like red and blue and all that. So let's take out the keyboard on that car first. So let's see what I need. Mean, this out. So here goes the keyboard right here. Not bad, not bad at all. Uh -huh. <laughs> right here. Red keys. Not bad. Only con it has on it is it's wired. And let's get the keyboard. Get the uh, mouse next. This is the mouse that has sniper shot, scroll wheel, DPI increase. I don't know what DPI means yet. Turbo fire. Okay, it looks like got a few hacks on it. All right. Let's see this baby. That's what it looks like. So yeah, it has a scroll wheel on it, of course. Turbo shot. Sniper. It's not bad. Not bad at all. This is the wireless adapter. I already said. Let's see, this looks like. Thank you. Yeah, it comes with a disc, of course, so you can. Final going on, and this is to get wireless internet, wireless Wi Fi on your PC in case you don't have a Ethernet or router next to it. Not bad. Not bad at all. Mm -hmm. We got another disc for the setup of it, I guess. Take this out for y'all. That's the HDMI cable. And like I said, this. That's the driver installation. Let's go back to the PC. Get out of here. Mm. Oh, 
gonna show y'all the box too. Cause I ain't gonna show y'all the box. It doesn't really have anything on it. It just shows you the ultimate gaming system. Let's go. And it gives you the specs and everything about this computer. Be carefully. And there we go. Not bad at all. Not bad at all. And then. <sighs> Set up. Alright, y'all. So here's the Cyber PC when it's all uh, ready and set up. I have mine set to blue. You can change that by just like, uh, there's a button underneath right here. And it's like set towards this one. And that's going to change color. See, it's going up to blue. You can just pick a color. Mine is on blue. Change that back for you. Yep, that's mine. And it has uh, enough USB cords and everything. So this is my hookout and everything. Uh, I'm going to show you guys the setup and everything to my videos, to my streaming on it. And it has uh, the old school port, just in case you want to use the old school thing instead of HDMI. Uh, it, has, it has two HDMI cables on it. It's got one right here, one right here. Let me show you all that. It's got one right here. And it's got another one right here. It's plugged into here, right here. And then, the cooling is pretty good. It's pretty cold back here. It's not hot at all. So the cooling system is pretty good. Uh, I still recommend if you're going to be playing this, if you're going to be using it as like a PC gaming, like gaming, because for me, I, I used to stream on my PS4 because I'm a console player. But I will be thinking about going to PC if I really need to, if I really upgrade this. But this PC is perfect for streaming, works perfect for me. And it has um has more stuff. So it's got one, two, three, six USB ports you can put on on the back. And it has like an adapter, an adapter USB port on here, which I have my uh, mouse and keyboard plugged into. And you can use those for various amount of things. Uh, yeah. And it has a headset port and a mic port right there also. And if you guys know it comes with this, that's the wireless uh, internet, the wireless Wi-Fi adapter. But I use Ethernet cable for mine. So yeah, I like wire for PC better than uh, wireless. It runs faster, obviously. And it has more stuff also. I'm not really, I'm not really sure what these are for. But yeah, it has Ethernet port. A mic, yeah. There's another mic port and all that stuff back here, and it comes with a free headset also. But for me, it came in the mail. I'm not really sure if it's gonna come in later for, for you guys at all, or it's gonna come with the PC. But because mine didn't come with the PC, and obviously I'm, I'm filming this on other, another time that I did the unboxing, and but it doesn't matter. Um, here's a off port. You better not have this on sleep mode when we turn it off. And there goes the power cord. Got that plugged in way back there. And then the power block is not really huge. Pretty small, pretty tight. This is just like the PS4 power cord. Besides the black for it, it's not huge. And um, yeah. If you want to put it in sleep mode, this button puts it in sleep mode and it turns off also. And I have my setup right here, everything going on right here. Uh, yeah. I'm going to show you guys my gaming setup on another video. I'm probably going to upload that tomorrow for you guys. But yeah, it comes with a pretty good mouse and keyboard. Um, I bought the mouse pad at another place. I am going to upgrade my setup uh, later anyway. I'm going to get another monitor because right now I have a TV and a monitor. And I'm not, not really liking the TV, but yeah, it comes with a pretty good mouse and keyboard. Got the uh, headset thing and everything on here. Uh, pause, everything for music. You want to play music in there. Pretty good keys. They, pretty, they work pretty fine. The, the mouse is my favorite thing about the mouse and keyboard set. It's pretty good. It's got the 4 or 5 on it. Got the uh, sniper shot thing on it. A pretty good... Uh, roller on it and yeah it's pretty good 
mouse and keyboard overall pretty pretty good for a starter just like i said if you guys are going to be playing if you guys are going to be upgrading to a pc from like a console to the pc or switch yeah um i recommend buying this first but if you're really going to get into it yeah because the the games I play on there, it, it runs at 60 frames per second, which is pretty good, but I'm not really getting a hang of the graphics card and everything. The graphics are pretty decent, but they're not like top notch and everything. So I will recommend upgrading because because my processor is an AMD RX 5, 560, I believe. And the next upgrade I'll probably get is a 580, and the 580 is a big difference. If you guys believe it, the specs should be on there, and yeah, um, overall it's a pretty good con. It's a pretty good uh, PC. My apologies for a starter. If you're switching from console to PC, or if you're just gonna use it for uh, streaming, which I am, it's perfect for streaming. Perfect. It works perfect. And the cost of this is six hundred fifty dollars, and plus tax cost me like seven hundred dollars, depending on what state you live in. And everything how taxes work over there but it was a pretty good thing um i would recommend using this and this is od right here this this is the thing i love about gaming pcs the most this shit, oh my god that is amazing see right through it see the uh processor and everything the cooling system everything in there run just perfectly and i might um i might re i might actually record me Upgrading the processor if I get into PC gaming, but I doubt it's gonna happen anyway. I like PS4 just fine, so I'm just saying works pretty fine. The specs and everything runs pretty fine. It comes with it comes with Windows 10. You don't gotta install it at all. And yeah, I'm guessing that's all. Everything runs at 60 frames per second. <coughs> uh, if you guys want me to like record. Record me playing a game on here, like Overwatch or Fortnite or something. Just comment below, and I'll do that guys for you, so you guys could see how this system runs on games like that, on games playing your console. And yeah, that's that's it basically. Uh, like, subscribe, and comment for more unboxings. Like, subscribe, and comment for more of Manta AF. Uh, subscribe. I'm gonna be going more. I'm gonna be streaming every day from now on. Uh, stream uh, Black Ops and Fortnite a lot. Uh, as you can see, it's my background I changed in the past. It's a Black Ops 4 background, and that's the game I'm going to be playing when it comes out in the stream. Because you know all the games come out. Black Ops 4, Red Dead, and Fortnite. You guys can be able to... Ooh, and they all have battle rails too. So that's going to be fun too. So yeah, like, subscribe, and comment for more of these unboxings, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.